I realize I have a little bit more to say on the meridian system because although we looked at the Jing Mai, these regular norms, streams, life-giving streams, we looked at the Lo, which connect, we looked at the Jing Pie, another means of connecting the yin and yang, and we looked at the Jing Jin, these muscle groups which are around the main Jing, the main streams. I did not talk about the Qi Jing Ba Mai, deliberately, because it is such a big subject. The Qi Jing Ba Mai are the eight extraordinary meridians. Uh, usual translation, here we have the character for Qi. Qi. Yeah, sometimes written Ji. Let's come back to that. Jing, let's call them meridians or channels. Ba is eight. Mai, how can we translate these things? Vessels, the usual translations. The eight vessels of the Qi, Jing, the extraordinary meridians. Now, to understand the concept of extraordinary, we need to go back to the Chinese and understand the concept of ordinary. Ordinary is Jing. Ordinary. Regular. Normal. Quite a nice word because it gives the norm, gives what is normal in the body, helps homeostasis, if you like, to, to bring everything back to the norm. This is Zheng. The Zheng are the regular network of the 12 meridians. They are Zheng. But there are the Qi Jing, the extraordinary meridians. Qi is uh, it's, um, strange or wonderful or marvelous, special, unusual, uh, remarkable. It's uh, something extra. And it's also a mathematical term for the little fraction which makes everything different. You know, that we know that the year is not 365 days long, exactly. It's 365 days and a chi, a little chi, which makes it uh, a little bit different. Nothing is exact. There is a chi which uh, is at the basis of life. So we have the ordinary and the extraordinary. We have to be careful here. They are not extra. You know, you have a bundle of 12 main meridians and you have some extra ones free. It's not like that. Extraordinary, they are extraordinary because they are out of the ordinary. They are not ordinary. They are underneath the ordinary or beyond the ordinary. And there are eight. I will talk in this DVD at, after looking at the 12 ordinary about two of the extraordinary, the Ren Mai and the Du Mai, which is the sea of yin and yang, which are ever circulating in the core, the inner circle of your body. So we will look at those two. Let me just write the Ren, which is the sea of yin, the Du, which is the sea of yang, the Chong, these are the eight, Chong Mai, a powerful sea of blood, responsible in puberty for the transformation from a girl into a woman, from a boy into a man, through blood, through the uh, power of the blood circulating in a different way, both for a man and a woman, giving rise to uh, sexual changes at puberty. Uh, the Dai Mai, a belt circulating around, holding everything in place. The Wei Mai, 
Wei means to integrate. Wei is a net, like the internet, connects everything together, like in a constellation. And there is a yin way connecting all the yin together, and a yang way connecting all the yang together. And finally, we have the chao mai. Chao is the heel, and they come from the area of the heel, and they come from the foot and go up to the head. And they have different uh, functions, but the main function is to regulate the movement of the yin, yin chao, and the yang, the yang chao. So these, in very brief way of putting them, are the qi jing ba mai, the eight extraordinary meridians.